Here they decide to go. All towards B here to start off, Doug. And it looks like the Guiding Light will lead the way. A few stars in place to shut him down with the Nebula, but it's not going to stop. X out on the way in. No, it's not. FNS and Marv aren't going to stop him either as they drop instantly. The remaining members of Envy are starting to rotate. Two from Defender spawn, one from Attacker spawn. Keep an eye on Ye as he's going to be on the sole mission to work his way around. Members of Exet have all huddled back into the site. They don't have B main control at this point. So it's just going to be chaos just a couple of moments away from this. Breaking out as the spike continues to take away. Death just down to 41 health. His Fury's already spotted one. Ye gets the first. The Shock Dart gets the second. And BCJ cleans it up with the third. Exit win the pistol. Wow, look Firing at Exit go. Look at him go. Starting death. off strong no with a huge pistol here. Four whatsoever. left alive. And BCJ like getting three. One of the best players in North America. Complimented by Def. Gamer. British. Man. Okay, I don't know about that analytic work. Best gamer in North America? <laughs> Calm it down. Out. Calm it down. I'm trying to hype him up, you know? Xset's going to fucking Berlin. Who are you rooting for here? Envy. Oh. Of course. Yeah, they're in your heart. <laughs> I got a win in Berlin, too. <laughs> so. They don't have that kind of talent. They got talent, but I don't know about winning Berlin talent. You know what I'm saying? We'll see. We'll see. True. Noting BCJ because he got those three. He was able to get a guardian. Look at look at how Envy are pushing forward. It's a That'd be so epic. That'd be so cool. Trades it out. And that's all it's gonna be is Marv manages to Boom, boom, boom. Uh oh. Towards Tyler. They saw him, so they know he's here. Marv takes down Pure, and you saw him being watched there as well in the mid. Oh, Looking dangerous. It gets taken out, and now Exet is somewhat resetting. They're like, oh no, Marv. They have an idea what a terrible spot to be in. Yeah, that's that that terrible. It's awful. <laughs> go spawn, go be main, <laughs> just do something else other than there. <laughs> what the, yeah, like actually <laughs> terrible. So yeah, I'm exposed to everywhere. Well, they got a crossy though. So if he gets two, the round's over. Oh. Is gonna come out from second. So what's the goal inside? Mm. FNS in a cheeky corner, not mm. even get anything going either. Crashies drops his. Yeah, Marv definitely needs to scrap that one from the playbook, scrap it from his mind. <laughs> Just get it out. Be cruising around, feeling good with that specter. As he pulls up some frags, nine across the top three, and uh, order of frags there for BCJ, Def, and Zekin to get themselves set up for alts later. This is not good. See that Def mm, is just a few mm. away from that cosmic divide. Zekin's close to having the seekers, which can really oh, they got sort out. Not a lot of money. Zero dollars on two of them. <laughs> get some orb focus here to start that off. Looks like Zekin might grab this right off the bat. Envy has a different idea. So they should grab you well. That right off the bat to push them back. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah. rock a blade point. I hope people buy my skin. Uh oh. Yeah, he's looking slower. We talked about how Victor getting across could be problematic. It's exactly what happened. Second gets cleaned up. Victor's going hunting, pushes BCJ back. Oh, Marana? <laughs> that was kind of sick. A little pot em. Yeah. Getting in the match, you're feeling each other out. Pot em. Saying, oh, they're, pot they're em. not there yet. They're Playing they're Overwatch? Up. Now you're taking Why? everything into consideration. Play the match? Oh, uh, no. I was a Priestess of the Moon. That's Marana's oh. name. Dota, Dota 1. Like that. Gotcha. Third round here, and we have a slow push by Xset. They're taking A. Yeah, they should be able to get on. Play Dota 1? Mm -hmm. Dota All Stars. I played it way more than Dota 2. Holy shit. That's crazy. Yeah, and that's why I, that's why I love Dota 2 when it came out, and then just I don't know, got a little crazy for me. Yeah, Dota 2 is Dota All Stars is so simple. A handful of items. Got a lot of characters, but. You know, I learned something about that door recently on a site. Mm -hmm. If you shoot the top, it does more damage than the bottom. Or you can what? No, maybe not. Bullets, but I saw a raise one satchel the door if you do it at the heart, high part. I don't know why. Well, sat satchels do more environmental damage. 
So a satchel, but, a satchel does bonus damage to a, a sage wall, for example. No, 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 I get that. What I'm saying is if you put the satchel on the top side or the top of the door, it'll one-shot it. But if you put a satchel on the bottom side of the door, it won't one-shot it. Kind of strange. You'd think it would be the middle. <laughs> it's not. It's the top side. Yeah. Huh. Like the very top, it actually works. I saw it on Reddit. I was like, what? That doesn't even make any fucking sense. So does that mean you, someone should try that with bullets? Just shoot like I don't know 10. if it works with bullets, but yeah. I mean, if I it does, that's it. huge info. Yeah. Well, like imagine it's a raise setting up his teammate to break the door in one satchel and he's like pre-aimed at a certain spot. They're not going to expect the door to break in literally one hit when it's full green. That's true. That's very true. You know, you could set up a pre-aim with your teammate and then satchel it at that's the That's actually top. so I have to try that now. Raise yeah. main? Hopefully they didn't patch it. This was like a week ago I saw it. You don't see Raze too often anymore. That's why I'm, I saw Victor on it. I was like, yo, he should fucking do that if he knows about it. Yeah, you really don't see Raze's as much. Their impact, Raze's impact has kind of fallen off a little bit. I mean, because they nerfed her fucking ass to the ground, man. $400 bot, are you kidding me? Minus 400 every time. Push him almost immediately, and that's a solo push coming in as well from Aaron. He was just super confident there. It backs up now that they have a little bit more control. So they have bot control over mid. Any movement for that rotation will be detected if they're coming out of March. <laughs> oh my god. So what a shot. Wow, they got fucked. Exactly. I was about to say he just that got double ghosted in the brain. I think I messed that up. Either way, you get the point. They weren't going to get bit by that again, but they've gotten onto A one more time. Envy looking to fight for the Reaper's back. They have rifles. Exit's in a pretty good spot. As long as we mentioned the Seekers, it is on the right now. See? Zach, and considering it, there it is. You is it just me, or is this just stupid? The like, the, yeah. all the spamming yep. and shit. Like, look at this. This is half the strat when you play underneath or on top. Yeah, I don't like it. You have one person spam, and the other people cover or take it. Like, it's, it's, it's actually just, such a... In my opinion, it's such a bad design. I don't like that at all. Just fucking, oh, here's Sova Dart from up top or down low, and then just, all right, I'm going to spam. Yeah, I agree. I'm not a fan of that. <laughs> like, I, 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 like, I like the hell spot, but um, at least give, like, a non-spammable path or something. Or, or a less spammable one, like a metal sheet is on top, so it doesn't fucking own you. Yeah, like it does, like, less pen. Yeah. Very aware that Victor could be hiding behind him. And well, to be honest, it makes for bad content too. Nobody fucking is. That is true. Nobody just wants to see fucking spam wars on a site. Yeah, it's really annoying too when it's an Odin and you're just holding mouse one through the fucking floor. Yeah. Like, okay, dude. Yeah, I, I, I disagree with the design as well. I don't mind it at B because at least it's only at that entrance wall. Mm -hmm. But when you have a hold of a site and then you're just holding it by banging a wall all day is so weird. And wine just yet. And they're going to play this one slow. The turret's there. Orb control is something they can definitely focus on. They have the lock. So yeah, the satchel still works, I guess. Someone just tested it. The only thing they have to worry about oh. is if they get stuck in both right out. Of us, that showstopper coming through like a freight train. Mm -hmm. He's playing off of that like I love how much you watch Valorant and how little you play it. It's actually kind of funny. Uh, do you actually like that or are you trolling? No, I like it. I wish you played more though. So it'd be Quiet. nice to, you know, duo with, with me. you. Gotcha. True. But you got Sean. Yeah, but like he's not you. Sorry, Sean. I mean, that's true. Last I checked. <laughs> Last I checked, he's not me. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Sean's gonna be so sad when he hears that. I can't wait to see or hear his reaction when he hears that. Where, where is Sean? Somebody find him. Sean is actually, I'm look like, I'm I'm so glad that Sean introduced me to Sean because he's just a good person. Like he's just so mm. he's he's a good person and he's fucking funny, funny as fuck. Oh yeah, Sean's a good dude, but again, he's not he, me. But yeah, of course, he's not you. So <laughs> there's only one of me. Turns out, I gotta be honest. Like I do like Sean a lot. I, 
he's become one of the crewmates. Yeah. Rushies. Nice, nice, nice. Getting around on the board. Low money sucks, but whatever. That's a big one. Rounds around. He got his ult. Marv's got his ult. Yeah. So many times he could have peeked. He was using the information of his teammates. They're running a double jet. I'm surprised. Usually people don't do that on a set so anymore. A lot of patience there shown by Crashies to make sure they are able to pick up that round. Here, finding one, and then instant spams, instant spam. Pressure from the side, util usage, and only once they're sure, they go together. And again, like if Crashies doesn't clear out, I want to see like a five flash lineup. Right, because Crashies doesn't have that much room. To like an omen, a sky. Uh, a KO, very well played by him. Mm. a breach, and I guess Reyna or Yoru. Yeah, I don't know why people aren't running Reyna. She's literally the most broken duelist in the game. It just pisses me off. Well, because in order to capitalize her, you have to you have to win the first duel. If you're not winning the first duel, she's utterly useless. Every time I've seen Asuna and Tens play Reyna, they fucking dominate. They have rounds that literally win them matches. And they just, for some reason, are on Jet. Give Shazam Jet. Sick, put Sick on the fucking... Oh, Soba. yeah, no. If it, if it was up to me, I would take a Reyna over a Jet. I don't think Jet's very good. Well, you can bring both. Shazam's a great Jet. Any ops. That's all he plays in fucking ranked, pretty much. That and Sova. But six a good Sova, too. Jesus. Oh, my gosh. It's all contact, but Crash just comes up big again. Oh, baby. He's the impact. Yep. Crash is. Save this round, potentially. Especially with Victor right-clicking for fun. Close range. Oh, well, I like this Aang, actually. Yeah. Never mind, I don't like... I didn't like that Aang. That's what I was saying. I mean, if he was standing, it was good, but he was crouching because he didn't want to get hit Order from... Yeah. Wow. No way. That's good timing. I mean, that's a Phantom kind of play, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's not going to work with a Vandal. I am, I am, I am back on the Vandal, by the way. Back on it. I don't know what it is, but I am fucking back on it. And it sucks. It sucks. The Vandal sucks, but I just like I, I don't know. I, you don't right there. He doesn't win that. No, he doesn't win that with a Vandal. No way. No way. But I don't know what it is. I feel like I'm just back on the Vandal. Like my brain is just like fuck yeah, let's go. Even though I know it's not good. I mean, it's not bad. It's just not as good as the Phantom. The Phantom's just a superior choice. That's the only issue. You did hear Ye use Looks like even in this lobby, everyone's back on the fucking Vandal. What happened? Sent? Maybe longer range fights? I don't fucking know. As far as weapons it goes. Hmm? <laughs> Playing Duck Duck Goose over there. Ye gets peeked out. Almost spammed out. And he has a little less armor than he would like, but still a little bit to take one off the top if he does get hit. Okay, it turns out the guns don't do anything Second. on the door. Top yeah. or bottom. So just it's satchel. all the same. It's uh, 13 bullets from Phantom and Vandal. The satchel breaks it in one, though, at the top. Does that mean a classic is also 13 bullets? Is it bullets or is it damage uh, values? It just, this, the guy said Phantom and Vandal both take 13 bullets to break door for, from bottom or top. So, like, I don't know if it's 13 in total or it's based on damage. I would assume damage. Well, because if it was damage, then the Vandal, you'd think, would do 12, not 13. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, but it's also a rifle, so you don't want to... But, yeah. I you know what I'm saying? Know. Like, does a classic yeah, take yeah. 13 as well? It might. Imagine shooting 13 classic bullets so that are going to be there for a sec. Momentum goes in their favor, and you can say that for a lot of teams. Oh, they're a momentum-based team. It's like, well, yeah, because right. economy does help you do that. But right. seeing right. how much they play off each other, we heard kind of Victor talking about it a bit. You know, when Ye's on... Yay's on. It makes us feel on. It, everybody on X that seems to be feeling that vibe right now. They've gotten to two rounds that had to be defuses that are their losses, which means they've made it into the site on Envy each time, and Envy's had to retake. So X yep. set has a good read so far. They're playing smart, and we'll see if NZ, Envy can start to change this up maybe once they get an operator or maybe once they start being able to cycle the ultimates they now have over the next few rounds and rally back. I know that we highlighted BCJ um, and Crashies at the beginning of the series as the two players to keep an eye on, but I'm not going to lie to you, Riv. I'm, 
I love watching Death and FNS go head to head because again, it's <laughs> yeah. like it's a chess match, right? Like you've got these two folks who are brilliant at this game and at conditioning and and showing tells and li- and really manipulating rotations and everything that comes with with calling an attack shooter like this. And you think you'd get reported if you I did? Agree um, mm-hmm. That it's. I mean, really, it's a spectacle. Classic only. Classic, the, the classic only challenge. FNS has this clutch gene in him too that we yeah. know so yeah. well from watching him play and Daft. What did you say? So do you think you get reported and like ranked if you did a classic like, only challenge? Like that was a collab <laughs> and a spin around. Like, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> or you just drop for everybody? Yeah, like you'd be. I mean, you'd you literally, yeah, you'd literally be dropping guns. Like there'd be an eco round and somebody would have a fucking vandal. Like, it's not bad. Those ultimates, remember, are ready for Envy if they can start putting it up. We mentioned the Operator. It's now in the hands of Yay. They still have three ultimates to work with on the side of Envy as well. Exet have two of their own and two pretty considerable ones. Fin some. It wasn't your idea. They haven't shown much. It was right? mine. The Trailblazer early on, and this is the second time. You well, want to use this with Jeez. The cosmic divide is actually what's going to play contact. You see the smoke come out and the grab. Uh-oh. Okay. Ooh, yay. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. He just went AFK. <laughs> yeah, he's like, holy shit, hold on, I'm staying alive. Oh, I love it. He stays alive, too, completely. He's like, hey, guys, you want to help me or no? But look at Crashy. This is probably one of the best pickups up, high fives. What in 2021 from for Valorant. Yay. The monster has awoken a little quiet for the first few rounds, but... But you're right, it could be Honeymoon. There's a chance. It's like an inevitability for him, right? Like, you know it's coming, you just don't... El Diablo. Where, ...and that was it. 34 Whoa. health. Oh, it's just gross, dude. Believe the hype with Yay. Believe the hype. It's something else. D2 it's remastered really beta's out right now. Speed of those shots. Multiplayer, I think. Yeah, I, I yeah. gotta be honest, I don't, I don't yeah. care. Why? Well, it looks so sick. But like, it d- I'm just tired of these remastered games, man. Yeah, I want something new. D2 is a fucking banger, though. You're not wrong. I played the fuck out of it, though. I know what it is. You know, it's an overlay of a game. No way he got to play it. Now he goes in um, one gets out. I thought about getting some people and playing a little multiplayer, but I don't know if Necro's out yet. Because when I played it before, it was like Sork and and uh, bar, bar, Barbarian Druid, Paladin. Is Druid even in the fucking game? I don't even remember Druid. Did people play Druid? Was that a thing? No, yeah. I think you made that up. Yeah. Druids were a thing? Druids were a thing in D2, yeah. Why do I not? I feel like nobody played Druid. Actually, I don't think Druids were in the last beta. So I don't know what characters are in the beta now, but when I played D2 in the past, I really loved, like, I absolutely loved Necros. Which makes it tough to defend. No. Like Sean came into my chat and said, someone just linked me a clip in my Discord and it woke me up about how I'm not you. Good morning, guys. <laughs> it was bad, man. I mean, it's the truth. It wasn't really an insult. Like, it sounded like an insult on Mike, but he still likes you. Sometimes. Oh, my God. Jesus. Who is this guy? BCJ, are you me? Well, I mean, like, you like Sean when he plays well, but when he plays bad, you're like, dude, come on. True. Are you nine and twenty-four? True. That happens quite more than I than I'd like, but <laughs> happens to everyone. Just not as much as Sean. <laughs> gotta find the kill somehow, dude. Start baiting. Do whatever you gotta do. Get him. It's funny because when he when I when he plays without me, he's just dropping twenty plus twenty five MVPs. He plays with me, I don't see that ever. I just don't see that. I think he's nervous. That's fine. What's not to love? Don't worry, Sean. You'll get used to the limelight. But then, when it's in a match time, he just dominates again. So, I don't know. True, he, was, he had that crazy cypher game in your uh, VCT quality. Jesus. A little bit of a waste of knives, but so let's secure this round. Clean. BCJ wins these. BCJ wins these. Don't fucking peek him, man. Oh, oh he's got a nasty, though. It was seriously close. He went into my chat and just typed, all good. 
with a this period at the end. That's it. All good. In the rest now as well with the trades and yay, they always feel like they're on offense. And here, coming from the defending side, they throw it into offensive. My goodness, dude. Talk about yeah. bringing out the best in one another. I think it was Belly who said iron sharpens iron, and yeah, baby, they're like full on sharpened right now. Except do have two ultimates to work with, and their economy's in this Wait. weird spot where BCJ is able to buy. It's Friday the Thirteenth. Yeah. Marshall, but Shit. Other than that, it is going to be pistols and the rifles and the enemy of Envy very well played. You see that like. That it's a tiny little thing, but they play off of each other, knowing exactly. that the trailblazer was coming. Yes, it's patiently understanding that somebody's going to be able to clear it for him. He can hold that oh, angle, deliver the off shot, and get the kill. Just quick play. He said, I mean, "Ban me, Shroud. I want to be banned." Utility, but the setup has to be in the right spot at the right yep. time, yep. and they find it. Let's Showstopper, go. Hunter's Fury, Cosmic Divide, three ultimates here for Envy, two away from tying this first half. Oh, over the shoulder, Ye takes that Marshall shot and will have to think twice about another peek. So other than those, those threatening shots there, things have slowed down considerably. You see two members of Exet and Kira and Zek can work their way around, but Victor's able to you know, really clean things up. He was just waiting on the other <laughs> side for him. So Zekin's in a, a pretty tough spot here, but they do have, all right, so check this out. They have mid-map control and they have the Seekers. There's something here. Left. Here. Here. The traps like rats. They're still in the back. The Easy hold five. here. They have got a lot of work to do to make their way in here. They've so lined necessary. up. They that sucks. Use it here. Numbers are already the they lined up when he did the recon dart, so it revealed. Ooh, crashies. Wow. Wow. Very good. Very nice. He's, he's very good at the Vandal. Wow. He's got a lot of them. Gabe's not even the top of his, his, his team. There wasn't, there wasn't well, that's assists only. Crashies Top frags. Pings on both members in market allows them to swing off of that with short time where they have to go, right? Like, there's no option to wait that out or to kind of feel something else that with only 12 seconds left, they had no other option. Crashies, it was sexy at the end, but the utility's feeling damn good out here. Absolutely great. It was a three. It made me excited. I just gave him a kill. It was a gimmick. Della Lucci. Um, well, yeah. yeah, seriously. I mean, he'll get it later. I was just I'll <laughs> spray control the out of track. this world. Uh, but that is absurd. Crashy's pulling another one up for himself. It's like so What the so fuck? Oh, my. He almost got away with it. Nice shot by one. And Depp is gonna be they used two ults down. to try to find the kill on that guy. Bummer. I mean, what do they have? Divided? Yeah. Yeah. Spike is down. 5v4. Divide boathouse and. I would, I would do something wacky and divide like. Oh, they're actually dividing boathouse. Okay. I love that from finesse. I love that. Oh my god, that was clean. Because that's no longer a safe spot. is just like. Oh, they did do boathouse. Yeah, they did. This is just. Finesse, this is just Finesse's game. Yeah. You know, like, that movement. It's just so. I mean, it's not much in Valorant, but that jump peak literally allows him to get that kill. Info kill. If he died, the trade would have been right there, too. Yeah. A lot of little time for his teammate. Six fucking six. What a close game. Dude. These Doug's these veins in his neck are literally popping out. <laughs> it's just it's out of breath. <laughs> we're we're going to go to break after that. We'll be right back. <laughs> He's amped. Doug is Doug is high energy always. Book. It's funny that you say that cuz Hannah actually asked. She's like, "Hey, we should read books. Do you want to read books?" And I was like, "Yeah, let's just make a library in our house." And she's like, "No, a Kindle." <laughs> I've only read a handful of books in my life. Books that I had to read for school, like uh, The Outsiders. Um, and... Uh, I think that's really it for, for school. I read... Uh, what's it called? Arag Aragon? Aragorn? The Dragon? I read that one. Um... I read, um, 
I read one of the Warcraft books. I read the, um... I think it was one of the first ones. Had to do with, like, Malfurion and Illidan. At the beginning. Horde meeting alliance. Shit like that. And look at how the flow of the game changed on the scoreboard, right? We talked about it in the beginning. Aragon? Yeah, Aragon. Isn't that the name of the book? to get the rounds where Envy's aim was coming online. Now we're refreshed, reset. Back from the and then they had a second one, and it was like instead of the drag, the blue dragon, it was the red dragon. Early investment of utility from Exet to control a long, but now and now they have presence in tree as well to be able to do that. So they're able to get one, but Envy trades out two of their own. Numbers advantage their ways. They're gonna get onto A, and they never. That's crazy. I've only read like three books in my life. But they never had to deal with the turret that they invested oh, in yeah. to get into that. Well, suck. The He's, of the wow, that suck is getting sucking off three men at once. Of what yeah. Happened. Victor falls. And now it's Counter just suck. envy to hold this garrison to sight. <laughs> so annoying. Is a little dance there in the well coming from Mars. 2v2 here. FNS. Mess relax. And I think I know why I didn't read as much. Mm. Because the only few times I did read is when we went on like oh, some sort of road course, trip. Actually. So if we had if, if me and my family were driving up to like the cottage or something, um you know, that'd be like a four to six hour drive. And I'd read a book then. But when I was home, why would I read a book when I have a computer? I would never waste my time reading when I could play video games. Let's see what I would only read to get sometimes uh, until I got a PSP, of course. Uh, exit to make sure this works out in their favor. So a little bit of you. You had a cottage. Well, it wasn't a cottage. It was a trailer. But yeah, it was a little cottage, cottage spot. It was like a trailer park kind of set up where everybody had trailers. Some people had cottages. Some people had trailers. It was like a mix. Gets a second kill as well. On to death. Second's able to clean that up, but Victor looking to do a little bit of rinse and repeat. No, falls at the hands of BCJ. As it looked like it was going to be problematic, they keep control of B, but the spike's actually in the opposite side of the map. Yeah, it, B gets open. That late setup from Aaron. He threw the turret down, fired some shots, and that's when Crashy said, Well, I know exactly what you're going to do next. It's reload. That's why he flies around the corner knowing that Aaron was still in setup mode and when the round started there. And like you said, it wasn't even about the B site in the first place, all about A. Now, everybody's at long here, which could make it difficult, but they have so much util on that spike. I think Envy's going to be pulling their hair out. That was so many shots. That was like 21 shots from the spectre to break that door. Damage base. Yeah, yeah. Now you've got to deal with contact with the turret. Yeah, he literally didn't stop moving. Yeah, I hate this gun. Well, at least he lost. Oh. <laughs> Time's running out too. He doesn't have a ton of health. What books would you read nowadays? If I was to read books nowadays, I would definitely read Marvel, Marvel related stuff. I would probably read like I don't even know if comics count. But I'd probably read like comics. Um. Um, or gaming related books. A lot of the Warcraft books are very, very good. So, if I was to read now, yeah, that's probably what I'd read. I would read <laughs> comics. I don't know if it counts as reading, but. It's actually going to be light armor on death, so he could be staying back and just setting up a lot of. I watched the What If series, the first episode from Marvel, and. While I understand the timeline and and why it came out, it makes sense with what's happening in their next phase of Marvel. But man, he was about to get killed too. But I didn't think it was very good. Hang out. Here is the start of here on round 15 with a nice headshot on FNS. It'll be interesting to see how X set oh my God, he gets the alarm bot was spotted. Oftentimes, when that alarm bot's there and it's been given away, it's easier to clear out, right? Like you can. What about reading Harry Potter? I mean, why read Harry Potter when you've seen Harry Potter? That doesn't make much um, well, sense. It'd be interesting to see if Aaron adapts and tries doing it in a different spot, a different location, to keep some some authority and some presence there without having to have it given up so easily. MCU fan hasn't read any comics. 
I, you know what I do more than reading comics? I just go deep. I go deep in the Wikipedias. I go deep. The support. Zekin, huge. has great first blood rates there, but is going to get taken down by Zekin from the side. Oh, Pure gets a second one as Marv trades it out. Now Pure looking to reposition, drops the door, and gets back into a more comfortable spot. This is over. Nah, Victor's still alive. Victor in this round is we're just down to 20 seconds left. They still haven't really gotten on the side, but Victor, Victor goes for two. He's going to True. That's gonna Actually get them on true. The two remaining members of Xset now rotating over in depth. Really nice. As it's gonna be another two v two. I feel like we've been here before there. Oh. Okay. Oh. Retake a site. Four v two? Question mark. Utility to hold a site. You got smokes on both sides. Nades for the others. And now it's all. Use your alt, Victor, here. right now. With the Phantom. Looking left, sees an elbow. Doesn't even need it. An elbow. Okay. And gets the bag in his mouth. The teammate, but Marv's able to make the hat trick count. Takes down Aaron That's a lot of sack tap. Dance. Oh, yeah. That was like 15 taps. <laughs> yeah. As we move on to round uh. 16. Crashy 17 and 10. BCJ 13 and 10. It's a stooling solo. It's clean. And you know, we, we clean, saw mean machine. the setup. What it was that, that Xet was trying to do. Def swung out. And it looked like Aaron was trying to work in through tree. But Def swinging out a bit early didn't allow them to apply pressure mm -hmm. at the same time. Right, when you do something like that from different angles, it divides the attention of the team that's trying to hold the site. Obviously makes it much more difficult. The timing just seemed like it's just a bit off from X Ted as you see now. They're looking for pressure down B themselves. Lighter by just run just backwards and hold it. Nice little guiding light push off. They continue to change the placement of the turret when it's been seen over at that B site. So always to keep envy guessing in that. The one thing about comics, I've always wanted to read them, but I just choose to read Wikipedia databases more. Is because comics, there's so there's so many of them, and they all do different things. There's so many versions of one character and so many different timelines of one character that I'd rather just have it condensed than. And when, when you don't have a ton reading a full disposal, comic kind of or a couple kind of comics about a character a in a timeline that really isn't that important. Right, to take that space away. He's respecting it. He's got the alarm about to swing Ooh, out with. Now that they've got tree, they're going to be able to work their way in. The pure is already good for one. Lean. Lean. Envious. Going to fucking Berlin. Make that one. As Aaron's left alone, and as I mentioned before, the site hit happened. He was on the opposite side of the map. There was no way he was going to be able to impact that. Better to read certain arcs and miniseries rather than an entire run. Heaven. Catwalk there. It was just kind of everybody standing there for a family photo, and Envy was all sorted out perfectly in the site to be able to take them down. Now we're in this 3v1. Again, Aaron being the last, having the full rotate over from that B site. Is his name Aaron oh, or Aaron? Aaron. Aaron. Often finds himself in one VX I think that's Aaron. Yeah. Come on. I mean, somehow, you, his names are strange. Okay. True. My name's nice Justin, and has a fucking nine in it. That that's true. Justify that. <laughs> Didn't look like he's gonna have the opportunity this time around, though. Did take one with him for his troubles. FNS got down to eight health, but Envy gets to ten, and now we're feeling some of the separation, right, between these two squads. Envy getting more. You think more Marv, the now, MCU is rounds, becoming overrated? Overrated? Uh, you're, no. You're, you're, you're nearing dangerous territory here if you're XF. Yeah, absolutely, especially with the way that the ultimates are starting to flow. The ones you have online at the Hunter Fury, Bladestorm, and Cosmic Divide are going to be a little bit more. I think the MCU is underrated Texas still. <laughs> I feel like it's still like, it's um, huge and it's gotten so big, but I still feel like it's underrated. That is that weird? I don't feel like it's overrated. After this one. So oh, they either have this? to be used now to get the money in your favor or uh, round after round to make it work. So slight difference in how Exit's playing things defensively. Look at the heavy presence mid. They invested three. They oh, away. yay. I thought he was about to pop off right there. I thought he was going to get three. The Hunter series come out as well, but Pure gets a second one across the middle of the map. Didn't you say the, 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 the I is the, is the nine, and that's the ninth letter of the alphabet, right? Yeah. That's so cool. They have ultimates to work with. So cool. Did you do that on purpose? Yeah, Victor. that was oh, the whole reason I'm right into that. Uh -huh. Cosmic Divide will so I got it from, do you remember Ryan in CSGO? Yeah. Zomblers? So I, he has on. a 9 nice. as an A, and I was Shock like, hold on, let me do some calculations here. And I did some quick math, sure. and then I was like, oh, 
Nine can be the I because I is the nine letter of the alphabet. And then that, that's me now forever. J9. And then you gave me the nickname J9, which is like one of the coolest nicknames I've ever heard. So that works as well. So I'm down. Hell yeah. down actually. Where is this we just missed a 3K. Scratchies is literally oh, carrying right now. Let him, it's fine. This game's over. You think? For the man. Yeah. He's I think they can come back. Nah, we'll go next. This point, and He's just a vandal god. He really is steady with this thing. Nice sidestep to pretty much deny that. First Have you gotten to play any of the new Halo yet? No. During the recoil reset. It just looks too Somebody easy. said we all know he misclicked the nine so because it's right above the eye. Envy's two away. Yep. That's good. But there's so many connections, you know. True. Let everybody uh, have their own interpretations of it. Yeah, he trades it out. Dude, I gotta, I gotta let it rip. Ooh. BC. BCJ shuts him down. Zulu. Tap, swing. Quickly, these rounds are going either way, mostly for Envy recently, but it is Xset biting back now. Yeah, Marv was in a, a pretty brutal position there, and I think... I think it's appropri appropriately moment, rated. That's fair. I actually right? haven't like seen Black Asian. Widow yet. You know, down, that's so weird. It's so weird that, that I haven't seen it yet. He found himself in what it's like it's available man, on Disney Plus to buy, and I haven't seen it yet. I have not watched it yet. Everyone and their mom knew Maybe I should just go to the theaters or something. He, Get a nice experience. He, 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 like, he can do anything without somebody knowing. Dude, I gotta poop so Did bad. Did you know that Gob B plays pro professional Valorant? Really? <laughs> yeah, he's on big for Valorant. Oh. They're like one of the best German German teams right now. Yeah, yeah I was like so rounds. shocked. I was like, dude, this guy's like 40, dude. What can they come up with? Maybe a little. I was like, shit, age don't matter. What's it's making me feel damn good. <laughs> what he's doing is. The fact that they're getting up so far, Ooh. they have all the info they need, Ooh. and XS not able to really. Oh man, Envy, Envy is gonna lose. Oh. Envy coming around the corner, and XS dropping him. Dude, Def was in a great spot, right? He was gonna be, he was like the last line of defense, and it looked like everything was on his shoulders. But then his teammates show up at just the right time, and it was like shooting. I saw Black Widow at my first drive-in theater. Oh, that could be so much fun. The map. You're right. Excellent response from XS. Now Still in this. Back on rifles, but I, I, was gonna I have to, dude. I wish they won these last two because my stomach feels like it's about to explode. I was literally about to say I got to poop. I gotta take a shit. A like I no, it's like it's like it's 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 peaking. Like it's coming out every couple yeah. seconds. You want to FaceTime each other while we're doing it at the same time? It's not a bad idea. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. But I, I don't, I don't have FaceTime. But that's fine. You can do it on WhatsApp. That's true. They're not going to be able to buy next round. Oh, please win this round. Exit to turn the tide of the game right now on this round. If they can get all the way to be here. We talked about Exit nearing a dangerous position, perhaps a point of no return, and they seem to have answered the call just fine. As now, Envy have made their way back on to B. The Cosmic Divide is going to come out. Yep. That's fine. Oh, no. Double kill, Joel. Uh-oh. This is so awkward, the timing. But the better one is the, oh, no. the better one's the attacker one. I don't know that there's a counter to that. This is it was so just weird. And it wasn't able to land. Wait. <laughs> one on each Why did he? <laughs> what is Yay doing? Are you doing on purpose? Oh, I don't understand. One player on each side, Doug. They're gonna have to go for the retake. Yay could have easily avoided that. Get back in. Uh, maybe he's holding aggressively. Oh no. Dude, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't watch this. I. I it hurts. It actually hurts so okay, bad. Go go go. It's not worth it. It hurts. Bro. I gotta go. Oh! oh my gosh, he knew. Oh my gosh. Wait! Did he win? No. No way! No way! Aaron! Aaron stops oh that my dead God. in its tracks, but I would have lost my bloody mind had he pulled that off. This is an amazing series already. Bro, that right was... I can't believe you play. walked Everybody away at the most insane moment. In the moment here. Victor coming up. Collat kill with the Phantom. Almost finds one in the back. Instantly decides to go for the showstopper. And Aaron... Finally resets the recoil because that was going to be Victor's kill if he had reset that landing. Oh my word. Envy, I think, are taking a tactical timeout here to do a little blood pressure check, and then they're going to get back into it. Dude, I might need one too. I'm like sweating. <laughs> uh, that was kind of hype, actually. That was just, that was absolutely nuts. And you mentioned the tack timeout, and you know, we, we joke around about Imagine if that was right. I'm just, I'm talking to both chats. I know Mike's not there, so don't say donut wall. Anybody? Don't, no, 
use that emote. Uh, imagine if that was Raze's old ult timer, like to take it out. He wins that round. No questions asked. The wind feels like it's gone out of Envy Sales at this point. It's going to be for Envy's this their sales. Yeah, Exit have won the last three. Like Exit, oh, I, I feel, here. I feel that, I feel that, I feel that. I, I, I misread for a second. I was looking away at the dog. It barked. Um, but you're <laughs> right, you're right. I'm back on track. Uh, but no, looking at what has happened for Envy, obviously they know they're slipping. Like we said, that last round was huge. So this was that 2,900 credit round for Envy, and a lot of their players had zero credits. So oh. they're not working with much util push. That's gonna be nice for them to get a, uh, a vandal in the hands of Marv. Ye is not able to use too much on that or get the blade storm this round. So, yeah. Envy still getting themselves into positions, I think, to get more audio cues here. So this half buy works for them. Obscuring vision. Think, but as she so aptly said, she punishes him in that instance, is able to get the kill. I I do like how Ye and Marv are playing off each other. So if Ye dies, Marv oh. is able to pick up the rifle and perhaps make something happen. But there just hasn't been a ton of value. Okay. From it at this point, Pure is already good for three with the op. Def gets the last one. Just a flawless round for X set. Yep, clean him up. Janitor work. And we talk again. We talked about momentum. That's four rounds now for X set. That's huge. It is so big, and it, it, you can see how much it actually makes a difference when you're kind of tipping the economy of the game. Two rounds ago, when we mentioned it, it's now in the favor of X set. So what that means now for this round is that if Envy doesn't take this, we're, it could be a win for x yeah. yep. If Envy does take it, good chance for x to go for a tie because of the money that they still have within their hold. It's just going to be a lot tougher for Envy here if they cannot get this due to the Econ. x have been doing a great job. So difficult to stress the importance of this round. Huge shot from Ye on the Pure there to get the op offline. I don't know that Def is in a spot yeah. to be able to pick Great it back up. BCJ, yep, trades it out, and that's big. Middle of the map, still comfortably in control. Oh, for now. <laughs> Both blade storms fall first. I don't even think they were used. And more headshots, oh more God. damage being done. Everybody getting peppered, but knowing they can't commit to these fights fully. They just need to be figuring out what's in front of them to use that for further information to come. Yeah, but this this is not a safe way to go. You saw the util investment early on. The oh dear. stars, the nano swarms, the alarm bot, the swing from Zekin as he's able to get two. <laughs> Marv trades it out. Aaron looking for a little bit more. One enemy remaining. Just on the other side, Def gets a spike as well. And now Crashies, Crashies has been so good in these instances, but it's not gonna happen now as X set tie us up. Dude. I love the fact that Zekin just sat there and hatched one of Aaron's swarm grenades as it came out. He was like, I'm just going to stay here and spray down in this. That's fine. <laughs> it's an unexpected, but also Zekin maybe knew he was dead to rights and doing as much damage yeah. as he could before he went down. So just overall confident play, not a lot of second guessing, but teams are really trying to read each other back and forth. We see the little peaks mid, but not full committals in the firefight. Then to Cat, but not Get the full committal. Way. We're at 11 to 11 now. It is all tied no up, way. and this is the Hold chance on. we were talking about where Xset could surpass Envy for the 13 rounds. As she's using the Hunter's Fury early on. I believe he may have gotten a tag on the one, but that's it. Ye did use the Blade Storm. And this is what you brought Ye on for. He's able to get one. BCJ trades it out. The Seekers are going to come out as well to severely delay things on to B. And you've got an excellent setup from Exit. Aaron's good for it. Barfed and crashes, oh, that's a however. Big yeah, but BCJ needs to back always up. The thing BCJ. is, they've gotten onto the site. Yeah, it, it is always BCJ, isn't it? They've gotten onto the site. They should be able to get the spike down. As Crash is looking out. All right, he's spotted here. I don't know that he's spotted BCJ, but they should know where they are at this point. Sitting on the potty, I'm a big boy. I can sit on the potty all by myself. Easy well, aren't you all big and grown up now, itty bitty Starts Mikey out. Woo? So Good job. Now, don't forget to wipe and then flush. The Not entry. flush, then wipe. What side do they watch? One's stairs and one's highway. 
Do they push in together? Right? <laughs> going from opposite sides, Crash is good for it. I just, and excellent uh, I just use of that. Is this is going to have to go. No, this is, gonna have gonna have to go this is for third seed. Well, type of both. Elimination. Or whoever wins is going to Yeah. Yeah. All right, so it's a pretty decent match. It's a close one. I think he lost I mean, this. kind of threw this. It's close. Wow, wow. They fucking won that round of Nico, dude. Oh my word. Yeah, this is pretty important for uh, Pujan. After he gets past half right, on the spike. One. That last moment of distance that Ye was Finesse going to Berlin? What did it for him? Pure Almost. Able to get to the, spike. These rounds down to the, the Giga Brain? One, though. With that so map still, point yeah, they made my, they went map one. It's over. It to <laughs> How does Whose map is this? Hold on, let's take a peek. How does NBA this is Xset's map. So yeah, they're going to Berlin if they win this. Excuse me from taking a cent, and you see them heavy stacked towards A. It's just F and S who's going to be playing on the other side. Make sure there's no heavy presence. And I was watching you guys play Gar Garctic Phone yesterday. It was fucking hilarious. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you like my drawing? Yeah. <laughs> we are yeah. not very good at drawing, for sure. No, that's why it was so funny, because none of you guys <laughs> could draw. <laughs> so Bro, it's hard with the mouse. It's hard, man. yeah. It's fun, though. It's fun. Yeah, I think if it's more fun, and... their one sucks. Except for Corey's girlfriend. Be the 4v4. Corey's girlfriend is insane. Joy for a race. You almost look at the utility on that yeah, she one, was like really good. She drew a teddy bear that... Like, I, I've never seen seen a teddy bear like that Earl. <laughs> there it is. Oh, maybe GG here. Wow. Tarek comes in and Trujan wins. Can I say, man? Has uh, Zacer been playing well on Envy? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's been really good. Really dominant yesterday. Living up to the name.